What's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm going to show you guys the top 4 best outfits to make for your male character using clothing glitches. So for the first part, I'm going to show you guys on how to get this pink outfit with the black joggers. And to get the black joggers, you're going to want to pull up your interaction menu, go to services, go to mobile operation center, and request your MOC. After you do request your MOC, you're then just going to wait for it to spawn. Mine will probably spawn right here. But once your MOC does spawn in on the map, you're then just going to want to head to the back of your MOC. After you do get inside your MOC, you're going to want to go ahead and go to the jobs inside your MOC. So it's going to say access mobile operations. After you are here, go ahead and hit right on the D-pad, log in, and scroll down to the bottom. And we're going to be using the work dispute so we can get the black jogger. So just go ahead and launch this job. And after you do launch this job, you guys will need a friend to help you out. And after you guys have a friend loaded in that can help you out, you can just go ahead and start the job. And for the difficulty, make sure you do set it to easy so then you guys do have more lives. But I'll just get back to you whenever I do load into the job. Once you load into the job, if you guys are the first player, which is the host, you guys will begin the black joggers. But if you're the second player, you're going to be getting the red joggers. Whenever you guys fully load in, just go ahead and head to your apartment. When you do get to your apartment, just letting you guys know, if you guys are new to this, you guys cannot see your apartment on the map, so you will have to remember where your apartment is at. So whenever you are at your apartment, go ahead and walk up to the blue circle, and you're going to want to go ahead and blow yourself up. You can use a rocket or a sticky bomb. So whenever, once you're in the blue circle, just blow yourself up. And after you do load back into the session, go ahead and just walk into your apartment. Whenever you're here inside your apartment, go ahead and go down to the changing clothes section. Whenever you're here inside the closet, just go ahead and scroll down to your accessories and you're just going to want to change one part of your outfit. So just change the gloves or you can change the shoes. But since I'm just going to go ahead and change the shoes, head to your accessories, scroll down to gloves, and you can just put on any pair of gloves that you guys want. After you do equip the gloves that you guys do like with the, with the outfit, it really doesn't matter. But just go ahead and save this outfit on any slot. After you do save the outfit, you can now back up, back out of the closet, go ahead and you can now pull up your phone and just leave the job from your phone. When you do load back into a public session with the black joggers, you can go ahead and head to the store so we can go ahead and do the outfit that you guys see in the thumbnail. Once you have made it to the clothing store with the black joggers outfit, you're going to want to go over here to your tops, scroll down until you find denim jackets on slot six, and you're going to equip the pink marble denim which will be right here on slot 7. After you have equipped this denim jacket go ahead and back out. Scroll down until you do find designer t-shirts which will be right here on slot 32 and you're going to equip the black print t-shirt on slot 59. After you do equip the black print t-shirt and the pink marble denim you can now back out of your tops. We don't need to worry about the pants since we already do have the black joggers. Now go over here to your accessories click on gloves on slot 7 and equip the black fingerless gloves on slot 56. After you've equipped the black fingerless gloves that will be all for your accessories. Now for the shoes you're going to click on canvas shoes on slot 4 and equip the pink S slab canvas on slot 13. Whenever you've equipped these canvas shoes back out and take off any head accessories that your character has and I'll show you guys on how to get the pink thermal quad lens later. Now that your outfit looks like this you're going to go up here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save your outfit, go ahead and back out of your saved clothing. Scroll down through the clothing until you find heist coveralls on slot 13 and scroll down from slot 9 through slot 12 and equip one of these outfits with the toxic mask. After you do equip one of these outfits, back out of the front counter and we're just going to head over here to the pier for the telescope glitch. Whenever you have found a telescope on the pier, just do the telescope glitch going run by the telescope like this. Press right on the D-pad, you'll see that your character runs in place, then looks towards the telescope, that's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu, go to your style, and go ahead and equip the outfit we just saved earlier at the clothing store, which should look like this. Now put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the mask merges with your outfit, just like this. All we're going to do now is just head over here to a gun store. When you have made it to the gun store, you're going to want to go over here to the top section, go ahead and hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit on any slot that you want. After you have saved the outfit, back out of your tops. Now we're just going to start up a job. Go to online, click on jobs, click on play job, click on rockstar created, click on missions, 
then you're going to look for the job that's called a titan of a job and fully start up that mission and when you do load until the titan of a job you should see that your torso is invisible like this with the toxic mask go over here to the tops now hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit on any slot that you want once again after you have saved your outfit back out of your tops pull up your phone and just quit the job from your phone when you are back in a public or an invite only session run back inside the gun store now you're just going to want to equip an outfit that has a belt so if you already have an outfit saved with the cop belt or a paramedic belt you can go ahead and equip that outfit right now or if you don't go over here to the outfit section inside the gun store go to the diamond casino heist on slot 51 and if you go to group a sex gear on slot 20 you can equip one of these outfits with this type of belt or if you don't like them you can go ahead and back out go to maintenance on slot 18 and equip one of these outfits with this type of belt if you don't like these type of belts, you can then just back out and go to Prison Guard on slot 15 and equip one of these outfits with this type of belt. So you can go ahead and choose one of those three type of belts if you guys don't have a paramedic belt or a cop belt. But if you do want to get a paramedic belt, I will leave a link in the description for Xbox Series X and S and PS4 and PS5. If you guys do want to get the paramedic outfit with the belt, so then you guys will be able to go ahead and transfer that belt over to this outfit but i'm going to go ahead and equip the outfit with the paramedic belt so then i can transfer it over to the pink outfit but all we're going to do now is the merge glitch so i will leave a link in the description also for it's a g thing and you guys can click on that link bookmark it and then once you have bookmarked it you can do it just like crooked cop but for me i'm going to do the heist department merge so i will get back to you when i am at my apartment After you do make it to your apartment, you're going to want to go into the heist planning board room and go up here to the heist planning board and out of all the five heists, start up the first one that's called the flake of job. You guys can basically use any heist. I just say the flake of job because I just have this one ready to go. But once you have the flake of job ready, you're going to want to go to number two. So complete number one, which is going to be scope out. And then you're just going to want to do the second one, which is going to be called Kuruma. So whenever you have the Kuruma job available, launch that mission. When you load into the Kuruma job or the heist, just set your heist clothing to player saved outfits. After you do set your heist clothing to player saved outfits, you can confirm your settings and then invite whoever you want, like a random or a friend. And when someone does join, launch the job. Now that you're here where it shows your owned outfits, scroll to the slot to wherever you did save the outfit, which should look like this. After your outfit looks like this, hit ready to play. When you load into the job, all you need to do now is just pull up your phone and quit the job from your phone. Whenever you are back in a public or an invite only session, you're going to want to find a car. It doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or a random civilian car on the street, but you're going to want to go ahead and get inside that car, pull up your interaction menu and register as in secure or serve or a motorcycle club. Now pull up your interaction menu up again, click on secure or serve CEO or motorcycle club, then go to management, go to style and on your CEO style or MC style, scroll one time to the left and then one time to the right back to none, then hop out of the car and you will see that you do have the belt merging over with your outfit and you guys are able to keep your invisible torso. Now, all we're gonna do is add the pink thermal quad lens. So go over here to the clothing store. Once you have made it to the clothing store, I would recommend you to save your outfit first on any slot that you want, it doesn't matter. And then you're gonna wanna wait. So back out of your tops and you will probably have to switch your outfits so just like this after you did save the pink outfit and then wait for the loading circle if you don't see a loading circle wait about 30 seconds to a minute and then you're going to want to restart your game because for the thermal quad lens glitch for some reason whenever you get out of your car whenever you need to then your zebra quad lens will come off for some reason i don't know why that's why you do need to restart your game but after you do restart your game and you are back at the clothing store go over here to the hats go to helmets which will be on slot 16 and you're going to equip or buy the white open face helmet on slot 78. After you do buy the white open face helmet, back out of helmets, go to combat helmets on slot 23, and you're going to go ahead and look for the zebra quad lens, which will be on slot 24. Equip the zebra quad lens, make sure the visors are down, just like this. Now back out of the hats, pull up your interaction menu, go to your style, and go to your bike helmet and scroll through your bike helmet until you find the white open face helmet, just like this. After you find the white open face helmet on bike helmet, back out of style, and now you're gonna to wanna to register as a CEO. After you've registered as a CEO, you're now gonna to wanna to find a car and pull up your interaction menu up again. After you pull up your interaction menu and you find a car, hover over style and get inside the car. Now, once you are inside the car, go up to secure serve CEO, go to management, go to style, and on your CEO style, scroll one time to the right and then one time to the left, just like this, 
hop out of the car, you will see that the zebra quad limbs are still on your character. Now put away your interaction menu, hold right on your D-pad, and you'll see that the quad lens turn pink just like this. Now hold pad again, you'll see that the visors go down, and that's pretty much it for the outfit. So now you can go over here to the tops, the front counter, or whatever, and you can save the outfit once again. And after you have saved the outfit, that's pretty much it. So now, this is what the outfit looks like in the pause menu, but that's pretty much it. So now, we can just move on to the second male glitched outfit. Now for the second outfit, you're going to want to go over here to the top section, scroll down to slot 25, which will be special tops, click on special tops and go on slot 11, and you're going to equip the Panic Prolapse Basketball Top. For me, it's on slot 47, maybe it's on a different slot for you. I believe you guys unlock this on, or maybe in 2021, if you guys logged on on a certain day. If you guys didn't, then it's probably too late and you guys can't unlock this, so this is kind of a rare component to get. But after you do equip the Panic Prolapse Basketball Top, you can now back out of your tops, walk over here to the pants section, and this is just going to be the same thing with the shorts, the, just the same thing if you guys logged on on a certain day. You guys unlocked it. If you didn't, then you guys don't have it. But go to Sport Shorts on slot 8 and equip the Panic Prolapse Basketball Shorts on slot 1. Once you have done this, back out of the short section or the pants section, go over here to your accessories, click on Gloves on slot 7, and equip the Black Woolen Gloves on slot 58. After you have done that, that will be all for your accessories. Now for the shoes, you're going to go to Sport Shoes on slot 9 and equip the purple sport shoes on slot 71. After you have done this, back out of your shoes. Now for the purple quad lens, you're going to want to go over here to the hats, scroll down to helmets, which will be right here on slot 16, and you're going to look for the pink open face helmet, which is going to be down here on slot 85. You're going to want to go ahead and buy the pink open face helmet. Once you have done that, back out of helmets, go to combat helmets, which will be on slot 23, and equip the zebra quad lens on slot 24. After you do equip the zebra quad lens, you can now back out of the hats, pull up your interaction menu, go to your style, and you're going to want to scroll through your bike helmet until you find the pink open face helmet, which will look just like this. After you do find the pink open face helmet on your bike helmet, back out of your style and register as a CEO. After you did start an organization, pull up your interaction menu up again, hover over style, get inside of a car, it doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or some random car on the street, just go ahead and get inside that car. Now click on Secure Search CEO, go to Management, go to Style, and on your CEO style, scroll one time to the right, one time to the left, back to None, then hop out of the car. You will see that the quad lens are still on your character. Now to change the color, hold right on your D-pad, just like this on your controller, and you'll see that the quad lens turns purple, just like this. Now if you want your visors to go down, hold right on the D-pad again, just like that. That's how you guys get the purple quad lens. Now we're going to go ahead and get the mask, get the mask for this outfit at the mask door. After you do make it to the mask door, go over here to your mask, scroll to ski mask on slot 20, and you're going to equip the black tie ski on slot 89. You should see that it does merge together with your purple quad lens, just like this. Now to save the outfit, go over here to the hats, the mask, or the tops, or if you just want to go back to the clothing store, you can do that. But then now just hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit on any slot that you want. And after you have saved it, that's pretty much it. So now we can just move on to the third glitched outfit. Okay guys, so for the third glitched outfit, I'm gonna show you guys on how to merge racing shoes over to this outfit, just like this. All you wanna do is go over here to the LS car meet, which will be over here at this location. Whenever you do get into the LS car meet, go over here next to the clothing, next to this lady, and it's gonna say browse outfits. You're gonna wanna go and do that. Click on the LS tuners racing suits, and you're gonna wanna equip the wild style racing suit, which will look like this. After you do equip the wild style racing suit, go ahead and back out of your outfits. And now we're gonna go over here to a clothing store. After you've made it to the clothing store, you're now gonna wanna go over here to the top section, scroll down to fitted suit jackets, which will be on slot four. And you're gonna scroll down to slot 25, which is gonna be the black sharp fitted. Now, after you do equip the black sharp fitted on slot 25, back out of fitted suit jackets, scroll down to the bottom, which will be business shirts on slot 54, and you're gonna scroll down until you find the charcoal cuffed shirt on slot 17. After you do equip the charcoal cuff shirt, back out of your tops. Now, you'll see that the pants changed, but you still are wearing the racing shoes. Now, go over here to the pants section, click on jeans, which will be on slot one, and you're gonna scroll down until you do find the find the midnight camo fitted jeans, which will be down here on slot 67. After you do equip the midnight camo fitted jeans, you should see that the sh racing shoes are still on your character. 
you can now just back out of the pants section, go over here to your accessories, scroll down to ties, which will be on slot four, and you're gonna just look for the black tie, which will be right here on slot 52. Equip the black tie, back out of ties, go to gloves on slot seven, and you're gonna equip the black woolen gloves on slot 58. After you do equip the black woolen gloves, back out of your accessories, go over here to the glasses, click on casual glasses and you're going to buy and equip the black casuals which will be down here on slot 29. After you do equip the black casuals back out of your glasses head over here to your hats. Whenever you do get to the hats you're now going to go to bulletproof helmets which will be on slot 19 and equip the black bulletproof. After you've equipped the black bulletproof helmet back out of the hats you should say that the glasses on the helmet merge together. All we're going to do now is just go over here to the mask door for this outfit. When you make it to the mask store, go over here to the mask, scroll down to ski mask on slot 20 and equip the black tie ski on slot 89. You will see that the glasses do come off, but your mask and helmet merge together. So we're just going to head over here to the pier for the telescope glitch. Whenever you have found a telescope on the pier, just do the telescope glitch. Go and run by the telescope like this. Press right on the D-pad. You'll see that your character runs in place. Then look towards the telescope. That's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu. Go to your style, go to your accessories, and just scroll through your glasses until you find the black casuals, which will look like this. Your mask will come off, but you guys don't have to worry. Just put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the glasses, the mask, and the helmet merge all together just like this. Now, all you want to do is just go to the clothing store, save the outfit on whichever slot you want, and yeah, that's pretty much it. If you are wondering what it does look like in the pause menu, here you guys go. That's pretty much it for the outfit, so now we can just move on to the fourth male glitched outfit. For the fourth and final outfit that I'm going to show you guys on how to make, after you have made it back to the clothing store, go over here to the top section, scroll down until you do find shirts, and shirts will be right up here on slot 33, and you're going to equip the black tucked on slot 71. After you do equip the black tucked shirt, you can then just back out of your tops, go over here to the pants section, Scroll down to suit pants, which will be on slot six and equip the black slim fit on slot 32. After you do equip the black slim fit suit pants, back out of the pants section, walk over here to your accessories. Now scroll down to cuffs on slot nine or on slot eight, and you're gonna look for the black gauntlet for your right arm, which will be on slot 60. After you do equip the black gauntlet for your right arm, back out of cuffs, go to gloves on slot seven and equip the black woolen gloves on slot 58. After you have equipped the black woolen gloves and the black gauntlet for your right arm, that will be all for your accessories. Now walk over here to your shoes, click on sandals on slot 11 and equip the charcoal white socks. When you do equip the charcoal white socks, you can now back out, walk over here to your hats, go to bulletproof helmets on slot 19 and just buy and equip the black bulletproof. After you do buy and equip the black bulletproof helmet, you can now back out of the hats. Now we're gonna go over here to the mask door for this outfit. Once you have made it to the mask door, but before we go into the mask, you're gonna wanna equip the body armor on your character. So pull up your interaction menu, go to your inventory, go to your body armor, go to your show armor, and you're gonna set it to the super light armor, which is this gray vest right here. Once you have done this, back out of your interaction menu, go into the mask, scroll down to black claves, which will be on slot three, and you're gonna look for the skull loose black clave on slot 82. Once you've equipped this black clave mask, you can then just back out. Now we're gonna go over here to the pier so we can do the telescope glitch and merge the mask with the helmet. Once you do find the telescope, just do the telescope glitch. Go and run by the telescope like this, press right on the D-pad. You'll see that your character runs in place. Then look towards the telescope, that's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu, go to your style, go to your accessories and scroll through your helmets until you do find the charcoal bullet. You will see that your mask does that your mask does come off, but you guys don't have to worry. After you find the charcoal bulletproof helmet, put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the mask and the helmet merge together just like this. Now, all we're gonna do is merge the flight tube over to this outfit, so you're gonna wanna head over here to this mask door. After you make it to the mask door, walk up here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits, and you're gonna save this outfit on any slot that you want, it doesn't matter. After you have saved the outfit, back out of your edit saved outfits, Scroll down until you find flight suits on slot 9 and equip the black flight suit on slot 2. When you do equip the black flight suit, back out of the front counter. Now we're just going to run across the street over here to the strip club. 
When you get over here to the strip club, you're now just going to want to walk inside. Whenever you walk inside, pull up your interaction menu. You will see that the flight tube is off. Now go to your style and you're going to want to equip the outfit you just saved at the clothing store, which will look like this. Now put away your interaction menu, walk outside the strip club, and you will see that the flight tube merges over with your outfit just like this. Now go ahead and just get back on your oppressor. Once you do get back on your oppressor, you're just going to go back to the clothing store and you're going to go ahead and just save this outfit. And whenever you have saved the outfit, that will be all. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy these four glitched outfits for your male character. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.